Okay, so I finally managed to get a few things. There isn't much that I'm going to show you. So I just want to get this over with. And uh, before I want to start, I know this is going to bore you to death. Uh, Valentine's Day is about to come out next week. So if you really... So if you're interested, so if you're not a fan of the idea of the lovebirds or whatever, I think uh, going going to going to stores will give you a better price though. So I hope you guys enjoy Valentine's Day next week. Okay, let's move on. So, uh, I got uh, Detective Comics uh, number number nine hundred ninety five. Uh, you know this is actually now this is actually a long run during the eighties and the nineties though. So if you Love Batman, I think this issue might be for you. So I really enjoy the Batman series. I got the Dead Man Logan number number three, the mini series. So I really enjoy the whole story of uh, I really enjoy the whole story. I've said that a lot. And here's another new series which is called Old Man Quill. This is actually takes place few years few this actually takes place a few years in another future where uh, Peter Quill is still Star Lord though, so and his team is still and his team is still alive and well though. So yeah, I, yeah, I'll give that one a try. And here is the Flash number sixty three, which is called the Secrets of the Speed Force. There's a, you guys might know what the hell is a Speed Force. Speed Force is it's an afterlife. It's actually more like you wanna. It's more like it became like after you die, uh, you still relive, relive in another, another life though. So yeah, that's a very unique concept here. So these are these are four comic books that I got from from Golden Age, and I also got the NECA Aliens, the Ultimate Edition. This is the there's a ton of variants. There's the blue and there's the uh, brown version. Oh sorry. Uh, just so you know, uh, there's a lot of variants to this guy. Uh, my 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 version the blue one uh it broke on me it broke the arm i was really mad i was really frustrated that i broke that one so i hope i don't broke this one also though so i we need to be very careful with neca figures because they can break at all time though so during a qc issue so be careful with that so there's so at the at kinokuniya i managed to pick up uh zelda from a uh, twilight from, from from the Twilight Princess, uh, you know, I thought, you know, it's a good thing I got it at a good time. Uh, I didn't really have enough time to buy, to buy other Figma, Figma action, action figures because I was busy doing other stuff though, so, uh, so yeah, I'm, I'm happy that I managed to get this purchase. It costs a lot, but it's worth picking up. So yeah, this isn't really much. I know this isn't really the best video I ever made. And uh, let me know what you guys think. Please comment, share, like this video, subscribe, or follow me on Twitter, and follow me. And keep make sure you put the hit the notification button if you guys may wish to do so. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. I know this isn't like the best content I ever made. So yeah, I'll I'll be pre-ordering more games as soon as possible and be doing more unboxings if you guys wish to do so. Also, I've been enjoying Kingdom Hearts three a lot. So I so overall I thought it was good though. So yeah. Uh, I thought it was a great franchise. Uh, so I hope the fourth game will come out probably in the next few years. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoy the videos. I'll see you guys in Valentine's Day. Peace the fuck out.